all right so um hello hello another gpo video now so i'm recording this right after i eat sushi because i didn't want to lose the idea inside my head but it's probably been about two days for you since the last video so hello um what i'm going to be doing as you can see from the title is how to solo pensions with sushi now as you can see oh i made a video uh, it was yesterday for me but it's probably like six days ago for you I made a video on can I get a Logia on my first dungeon and spoiler alert I sucked ass and I like I lost inside dungeons with Pika. Yeah, go ahead, clown me or anything, I don't care. But I feel like it's gonna be easier with Zushi. Now, only reason I'm doing this introduction part again is so that I can show you my stats. Um here they are. You have 300 stamina. 20 black leg just so you can get Gepo, 200 defense that you don't get one shotted, and 385 double shoot and 50 sword mastery just in case you need. No, just so that you can like lock easier and stuff. Now let me show you the best things about this build. Um, here's your gravity push. It does 64 damage. You're not gonna be relying on that at all if I'm being like completely honest with you, but. Look at your meteor. It does. Let me see. It does 100 damage and it burns 12. Like it burns for 12 like twice. Now what you're gonna want to do inside the dungeon, which is what I'm gonna show you. Like this is honestly the same thing as Mira, but probably easier. You're just gonna. Um, I I messed up. I'll just do gravity fly. Just All right. What you're gonna do is you're gonna use gravity fly. You're just gonna hover up. All the way to as high as you can, and then you're just simply gonna do this. Summon so your meteor and kill everything. Like, just come up here, wait till everything groups up at the bottom. Make sure that you do it early because the one sword style users use Shishi Sun Sun and it like keeps you still. But then, yeah, it's pretty simple from there on. You can just come up here, you can even use this one if you need to. Because now that they come in everywhere, it's like you kind of can't miss it. You just do this. And since you have 1k stamina, your stamina won't go down that much. And at the end, you can even just wait for your stamina to regain. I mean, I'm going to show you in like the first couple of waves. Then I'm just going to go straight into 2 times speed to see what double fruit I get. I'm going to probably try to do dungeons until I get bored. So like 3 dungeons at most or 2. But it's all going to be fast for you. I'm just going to show you the first one. And then if I do a second and third, I'm just going to show which fruits I get. But, um... Yeah, I'm gonna go to dungeons now. Alright, this is honestly the perfect map. Like, this is the best map for it. Alright, let me show you how to do it. It's gonna be- Oh yeah, I don't have a load bar, so I can't just stand still anymore and stuff. Damn it. But, yeah, this is what you do. Once they're at, like, uh, pretty much halfway, like, this distance, you just come up here. Actually, I would say to go up before that, and then you just do this can't do anything you can even stay up here and just use it on the ones that's like far away like this because you can snipe solution. this is this is beautiful and for the boss um hold up i want to test something out right now because if you can do this for the boss then you will never get touched with this fruit in dungeons of course all right let's see can you summon your meteor over there no it hits the top barrier damn Alright, for the boss, I'm gonna think of something. It's probably gonna be easy as hell. Um, is there a way to fast? Gravity push. But yeah, that's pretty much all you do. I'm gonna do a short little jump cut until I hit the boss. Or I might just put it in two times speed, but yeah, you'll see.
All right, so I got a heat a boss, so this should be kind of easy. Let me try and bait it into the corner. Shit, I missed it. But I was lucky enough to get a heat a boss. Thank God. So it's just this is about to be hella easy for me. But I can honestly just do this. Like, what can you do about this? Silly little heat a boss. You can't fly. Um, if you get a Pika boss, good luck. But what I want to show you is that you can, like, you should go to that corner over there before the match starts. And you can just hide behind the cover, come out to only snipe them with your Meteor Strike. You can just do that. And I think if you have this build, you can infinitely stay on Gravity Fly. I did a jump cut, but I would, like, I didn't come off of this. Like, I just come all the way up here. I start charging a Meteor Strike. And then they all just come under me and it's this simple like you one shot everything you see look i'm gonna show you right here mm, any second now all right look see like my stamina just comes back instantly this is i hope this doesn't get nerfed before you gives it to that the longer that you stay on um gravity flight or the rock you just lose stamina over time like the pika nerf but yeah if you copy this build you can infinitely just stay on this rock come up here and do this now i'm not sure if you can do this on the other maps you most likely can because this is like hella simple and easy but what you do have to be careful for is a boss well not a boss the pika boss that boss is so dumb and brain dead it snipes you with um with light kick because it has auto aim and everything like you you need to be careful with that boss so that's the one boss i would say look out for you can still solo it which is why i recommend this map because it just makes soloing the dungeon like a lot easier but yeah you pretty much get what to do now so i'm just gonna go into two times speed but if i get a pika boss i'll stop the two times speed and show you how i um do it
all right so like my mic cut out at the end so i'm just gonna like revoice this over but basically what i was saying is how i i was just fighting the mirror boss to see if i could kill it but besides that to just wrap up the video i show my stats off again at the end page now for the fight with the pika boss i hope that you show it but all you have to do is just go to that corner and just throw your like just like just aim your cursor right where you want to put your meteor right there where the pika boss is standing and just keep on rapidly going back and forth within that corner that's how you do the pika boss if you're unlucky and you happen to get double on wave 20 like me but if you have any comments about it then just leave it in the comments so that i can see it but if you did enjoy the video and you're new to the channel feel free to subscribe because you enjoyed the video if only if you did only if you did